finally, the main road says the third, Seguin, Texas. Some friends of mine came by me, by me, by me. So I just said, uh, one of these days. And then uh, it happened. I said, hey, I'm going to see what the church is all about. And then I've been there ever since. Bravo Gomez. He bring my lawnmowers to my house. And that's how I got connected to this church. It felt like home. It was a real bad accident. My dad told me there were two eighteen with the one in front of me, one behind me, and then when we stopped the other 18 women came and T-boned from the bank and I flew out of the window, out of the front windshield, underneath the 18 women and they gave me up for dead and then my friends, the Rally boys, say, he's all right, he's all right, he's all right. And so my dad got broken his collarbone. My mom had a split her scalp open. It kind of scared me. And some people say I'm a miracle baby, but I don't know. I don't know. I don't know how I did it. You know, I have my several hundreds of times, hundreds of times while I'm still here. I just got one something to do with my life and I'm still right here. They say, oh, I, oh, I never walk, I never walk, but I overcome it. They took me to, they took me to San, San Antonio, and they took me to Austin, they took me to Dallas. They couldn't find nothing wrong with me, so. It happened, we were out in the pasture the one day, and this guy named Carl Willis, we never knew him, we never knew him. And it happened, my daughter was driving by him, and he had a flat tire on the side of the road. We drove right past him. And then something told us to turn around and go back. So, and then we went back fixed his tire, and then he said, you got kids? He said, yes, sir. He said, what's wrong with the boy? And my dad said, I can't find him, nothing wrong with him. And he said, I'm a member of Scottish Royal Hospital there in San Antonio. You mind if I take him? My dad said, sure, go ahead. And Carl Willis said, you don't got to pay for nothing. I'm paying for all of it. See, my daddy had back turned on me and I got I don't know if it was hot that one day. Uh, so I get up and fall, get up and fall, get up and fall. 
So one day, he took his belt off and then I got my hold of his belt and I started walking and never looked back since. They treat me like I want to have them treat other people. God is real good. Sometimes you have bad days, sometimes you have good days. But the man upstairs always knows. Sometimes you might, you might wake up and say, Oh, I don't want to do this, I don't want to do this, I don't want to do this. It happens to me a lot. I know it happens to a lot of people. But the man upstairs always take care of you. To my mama, to my daddy, to my neighbors. I love you, and I hope you come start coming to church.